Hello, in this Dart programming video, I am going to show you multiple class inheritance. So in Dart, you can't directly do multiple class inheritance. So I can't create a class like this and inherit from multiple classes. In languages like C++, you can. But what you can do is have a parent class. It can be abstract. It doesn't have to be abstract. It's totally up to you. That a child class inherits from but then you can have another class that inherits from this so it's a child of car so that gets all the properties of car car has all the properties of vehicle so that's one way you can sort of get around it but you can't directly just say the car class is going to have two parents unfortunately you can only have one in in, in dot so the way you do that is pretty simple you put the keyword class and then you name it something so if i just call it bmw for example and what we are going to do we just put extends so we just put the keyword extends and then we put the other parent class like so run that you'll see we get no errors we get no errors and if i just do a print in here if i just do not print i want to create a method first so i'll call it hey <laughs> We can do all the normal stuff like creating, you know, variables, methods, overriding, all of that cool stuff, getters, setters, it's literally the same, it's just a lower level down. So this is like a grandchild class technically. So if I do a print saying grandchild class, and now if I comment this in it, And I create an instance of it. So I so it is it is called B M W BMW and I want to call it B1 equals new BMW and let's put the curly braces semicolon and we can do B1 dot we can use the drive method, the hello method, which as you can see is not part of the BMW class. It's part of the car class and part of it's part of the vehicle class. So, so if we do, hey, run it, that works fine. And it's calling the parent and its parent constructors as well. And if we do B1 dot, drive we can use that as well so that's really that's all there is to multiple class inheritance unfortunately in dart you can't do it the same way that you can do it in you know, many other languages but this is the way to get around it but if you have any questions you want some assistance feel free to pop me a message and as usual i look forward to seeing you in the next video.